Hello everyone, um, yeah, long time no seek, uh, welcome back to another video, um, I'm sorry I haven't made a post in, god damn, two months, yeah, I know, it's been a while, so, um, today we're gonna make a, a video about a game that I play for at least two weeks already, and it's called Penguin Paradise, um, I'm, I was gonna plan on making a video about it, but then I had cool uh plans going on so i decided to make one uh a little bit later so yeah um penguin paradise it's just another girl attack knockoff game but way, 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 way. Oh. do you see someone without that in the game anything then in they the shop happen. in the game okay i don't know what just happened there but anyway was it's just another grill attack knockoff but way better because you get all these cool things because i mean there is a grill attack knockoff called penguin rush but this that is not compared to this game this game might be my new favorite grill attack knockoff because i mean it used to be capuchin it, i mean it's still in my second spot for knockoffs but my still my favorite vr game is still gonna be grill attack but this is my favorite knockoff game because it's just so much better and it's actually so more unique. And Sava, if you're going to watch this video, you've done an amazing job on this game. Like, congrats to you, bro. Like, you've done such a good job on this game. Like, I don't even know what to even do. So, today's is just the review of the game. So, um, and, and also just ignore that I joined a public. That was on accident. So... Let's go ahead and let's head on over to our first area. So we're going to go down the slide. Um, there are cosmetics in the game, but I'll do that uh, later. I did buy a couple cosmetics. So, yup. Um, so, and this game is just so much environmental. It's just so unique. Like, you, this is just basically like a like a ski map just just another hangout like area and it's pretty cool um this is the slide for you to go back um you could do this awesome like ramp thing where you just go like this doink 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 you can also do that with skis there's also another big ramp this is like a ski kind of ramp so if you want if you guys get and yes guys there is skis in a VR locomotion game finally something I really wanted Like this game just introduced like stuff that mod like moderators and they kind of need to use and it's just so cool um So yeah, that's pretty much it for this map. Let's go to the other things. I'm not gonna join them I'm just going to tell you guys what they are if you guys want to get an idea of what this game is Yes, I know a couple of YouTubers like Fire God made 2.0 made a couple of videos about this game, like events and like giveaways and like new stuff included. But my version of the game, but my version of the channel is just to have fun in VR games. I haven't made a video in two months, which I because I've been very busy with school, so I don't know. Okay, let's and they. Uh, so, okay, I'm sorry. Um, let's review some reviews some things. So, this is your ice cubes. It's your in-game currency, just like shiny rocks. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Let me get back up there. And I'm too lazy to do edits. I don't even know how to do edits, so I'm going to figure that out. So, this is your ice cubes. This is your in-game currency, that, like shiny rocks. But this time, it's ice cubes, which makes sense for a penguin game. Um, and this is the message of the day stuff. Um, and yeah, this is where you can buy ice cubes. I'm surprised they even priced this 13,000 cubes for $20. That's way better than 5,000 shiny rocks for $20. Even Capuchin does a good job at that too, kind of. Alright, let's go on through the game modes. So there's five currently, there's one in beta. So this is a new one that I played uh, yesterday. This is called Sled Racing. It's basically where there's two maps. You're racing against three other players to cross the finish line first, and then you win. There's two maps called Penguin Hill and... I don't know what the other one's called. This one is just basically just a hang another hangout area, but this time it's an actual open world where you can just go and have fun with the, like your tools and stuff. 
freeze tag. It's pretty simple. One of them, one of you guys is the freeze tagger, and then there is like a bunch of other players that try to tag you. Um, and yeah, and if the freeze tagger wins, the round restarts, and then there's a new person as the as the freeze tagger. Survival is not what you think it is. It's not like infection. It's actually where there is creatures or entities. Uh, that are bears or like wolves or polar bears or whatever you call them and you have to survive not getting killed and there's two versions which is the young one and the adult one um i honestly think in my opinion the adult one's a little bit more scarier because it has teeth and yeah okay so this is a yeti beta where one of you guys is the yeti because this is just the beta so i could be here for very long um the Yeti, the Yeti Bay is basically where there is one person as the Yeti and has to eliminate all of the players to win, to go to jail. And if the if the penguins have to collect three generator powers to power up the generators to get the wolves to kill the Yeti, and if the wolves do kill the Yeti, the penguins win. And yeah, and this is where you can buy your stuff. These are all the moderators and the cool team behind the scenes, and these are really cool people. Like you got. Tufa, Stunton, Kiwi, Spoofy, Toast, Zolan, Galkity, Deep Penguin. I don't know how you say that. I'm sorry. And you got their famous content creators like Fep, TV, GG, Pine, Styled, Snail, Jamin, Curly, and BMT. And this, and like I said, this is where you get all of the um, updates of the game. This update, this game updates really frequently, and I think that's really cool about it. Um, and this is the Discord server uh, link if you guys want to join that. And yeah, over here is I think the juicy part. This is the cosmetics room, and this is what the penguin mod looks like, and I think it looks really good. And yeah, so and these are all of the like mods and like winter stuffs you can get. So they recently came out with these new things that are called scooter, uh, rocket scooters. I bought this one because it just looks really cool. If we go to the mirror. You're on a scooter that you can fly with. Like, look at this. You can fly with this thing. And this thing is just super cool. And there's a couple secrets we can do, too. Um, and these are all of the limited cosmetics that you'll probably be seeing a lot. Um, I wasn't here during the limited cosmetics, so I couldn't really get any of these. I do see a lot of people with the candy cane and, like, the Christmas tree outfit. Um, this is the one during Thanksgiving. This is, I don't know when this was a thing. And yeah, so you got all of your cool cosmetics, like you got chain shoes, a snowboard, which is not really working right now, it's just basically on your feet. You got two beanies, you got two goggles, you got two coats, you got a sweater, you got a golden version of the penguin, like you put it on, you'll become golden. And if you guys hear this music, it's, it, I actually like this music, I think it's kind of satisfying. You got pink glasses, you got a New Year's top hat, you got all your scooters. You got helmets over here. I did buy a couple of these, so yup. So I bought the I bought this scooter because I thought that one was pretty cool. Uh, these are jump gloves, which is basically you just you bounce like really far, which is really insane. I mean, it kind of get it can kind of get annoying sometimes because if you're trying to take it off, it'll be kind of getting annoying. We can make it work. Uh, skis. This is what. It'll, this is what I wanted for so long in a in a VR locomotion game, because you get you get like uh, skis that actually float that actually work when you're on ice and snow, and make it way harder for you to grip, which is really cool, and I think that's a really cool inclusion. This these are jetpacks. These are basically just the scooters, but you have them on your hands, and they don't go as fast as the as the scooters, but you can make them work. I mean, if you guys just want to get something as simple like the... Oh, shoot. Oh, I put on the scooter by accident. Oh, and here's another thing i like to mention. If you have the scooter while the jetpack's on, it makes you go super fast. Which is insane. And you got shoes. Let me put on a couple of these that I have. So you got blue coats. Nice. You got the... Oh, shoot. You got the red coats. You got red goggles, which I think these look pretty cool. I think my favorite are the blue ones. Because they just remind me more of a penguin, you know? You also got uh, a snow beanie that I also have. It looks really dope. I also have snowboards and shoes. 
So as you guys can see, I have the snowboard, and if you guys look at my feet, you can see the shoes that I have on, which is really cool. And I already showed you guys the... I already showed you guys the, uh, oh, and also one more thing, the New Year's top hat. We gotta get fresh, you know? And yeah. Oh, one more thing. So these are the, like, mods and, like, winter cosmetics. So let me tell you guys what these are. So the paintbrush is basically where you make fan art for the game, like, like, drawing, like, for this game. Uh, anything that's related to the game. This is how you can get the paintbrush. The ice crown is how you can become the the ice crown is the only way the only way you can get this is you have to win in a contest or like an event of during the penguin game from the developers themselves. So yep, the pebble is a moderator cosmetic. It's only available for moderators and stuff, which is really cool. Uh, this the fish is a dev slash moderator cosmetic. So like if like Sava has the fish, so and it's not purchasable because you you have to be a dev or a moderator for the game. And yeah, um, and this in this game has amazing communities. I have not heard any single person be like rude or disrespectful. Yes, there was a couple N word people here and there, but still, but still, this game is pretty dang cool. I love this game, and that's pretty much what I have to offer. So. Um, I hope you guys enjoy the video. I'm gonna start making videos like every single weekend if I have enough time. So I hope you all enjoy the video and I will see y'all the next time, people. Goodbye. Also, oh wait, one more thing. Sava, if you're gonna watch this video, you've outdone yourself, bro. This game is amazing. Like, I don't even know how to explain this. This game is super amazing. Um, anyway, that's it. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see y'all next time. Goodbye!